What a great Joe Walsh tune, one of my favourite rock tunes of all time. He originally did Rocky Mountain Way in the key of E, but he's got a higher voice than I, I'm going to do it in the key of D. Feel free to change it, it's only blues chords in this D, G and A, standard blues, ones, fours and fives, but this is the sound you need. Ones, the D's, and the five in your right hand. The A, the five note. One, two, three, four, fifth note in the scale of D. And here's the sound you want. Moving down to the C. to forget this thumb in my right hand I find it gets a little thick down there sometimes and coming into the verse and in the verse that little figure D, G, F, D stand a little blues lick you can hear very buddy guy, yeah, right there. And it just pedals the D and plays that riff in between in the verse. Spend the last few rocky mountain ways. I couldn't get much higher. Riff D. Out to pasture. Think it's safe to say. verse and the intro sussed let's get to the chorus and we don't need the ladies it's just to a G so in your right hand there's your D and to get to the G all you have to do is put this index finger down and move your left hand to a G you don't need the ladies Back to the D, put your middle finger down on that A, move your left hand to D. Story sad, same thing again. Cause the rocky to the G is better than the way. Now it goes to the five chord to the A, move everything up. So it goes. have this song that's all there is to it so once you get comfortable and with Ones and fives, yeah, you can put thirds in occasionally. More about that in the advanced lesson. So once you're comfortable with what's going on here, come to the advanced lesson and I'll show you how to squeeze a little more out of this tune. 